Hello there and welcome to Fairland Cottage and thanks very much for joining me here today where I'm going to show you how I made a very simple utensil holder that you can bring with you on the go so that you don't have to be using any plastic cutlery or plastic straws and it also doubles as a napkin. <laughs> so let's get right into the video. To start with, get a napkin. Now this is one I had in the house and the measurements are 15 inches by 15 inches. So it's a nice square and it's just easy to work with. I gave it a quick iron just before I start making the design. And we're gonna start with making the actual pouch section. So just fold it over like so, about five inches. Get the cutlery that you're gonna be using and place it on the little pouch section with just a little gap at the bottom. We're going to measure where the pouch is going to start from. Draw a line there, about at the top of the knife. It's not really that fussy. You can leave a few of the utensils showing. And then draw a line the whole way across. And this is what we're going to cut the little pouch out of. Cut away, leaving about half an inch at the end. And then on the top section, mark it at half an inch and draw a line the whole way across. Now this is just going to be a very simple hem to keep it nice and neat because we're going to cut away this little section here and you can use that as a hanky. The little flap, just turn it under on itself, makes it nice and neat. And then on the bottom section where the cutlery is going to be, go down half an inch over at the side, cut that out and this is so you can fold it under so that it's hidden and again it's not going to fray. Give it an iron. Straight on to the sewing machine or you can do this by hand and go from the top all the way down to the bottom. Leaving about half an inch at the end. When you get there spin it around, head across the bottom, spin it around half an inch from the edge and all the way up to the top. So that's the basic pattern. You've got your serviette with a little pouch section there. And now we're just going to make a few little compartments. So from stitching to stitching it's four and a half inches. And we want three sections so I do it at one and a half inches mark it and at three inches. Now if your cutlery is different sizes than mine then just measure your own cutlery and just leave enough space for them to pop in. This is where we're going to sew two lines of stitches. Back onto the machine or by hand from the stitching all the way up and do the other section also. Reinforcing both at the top. And that's it. There's the three little pouches ready for the cutlery to go in. So place everything in like so. The chopsticks are usually the tallest. So pull the flap over there and then just kind of tuck it under like that. Roll it up. Now these are two little buttons, so we're gonna put these an inch on the end of the serviette so that we can just pop it closed and keep it neat. And when they're closed over, make a little mark where one button is going to go. And then on the bottom button, draw a little circle around and sew it on. And you can see in the back, it's a really neat little circle. I finished off with a couple of knots. The other button, draw the circle around where you made the little mark earlier. And sew all of them on. And there's our four buttons. Pop everything in, flap over, curl it under like so it up and two buttons to close so that it's nice and neat and there you have it it's really handy when you're out and about you'll be able to reduce the use of one use plastic and then you'll also be able to use a napkin instead of any paper napkins and that's it thank you very much for watching I really hope you've enjoyed this DIY and it's also a really nice idea I think to make somebody for Christmas thanks for watching say hi on Instagram and 
I will see you in the next video. Bye.